the reverse by itself. I tied that one down here just to see one at a time. Now obviously it's free low, uh, free uh, spinning. And you can't can't even grab the shaft down there. It's so uh, the whole thing weighs about 140, 150 pounds. Again, it's a prototype, so truly the wind is not that great, but you get gusts of six kilometers. There you go. And just grab it. So you see the direction of the wind. And the wind is coming from there. Oh, there you go. It's five. Five kilometers. So definitely the reverse is, is doing its job at very low speed, uh, air speed. Um, I'm definitely having trouble with the uh, forward one. Uh, it doesn't seem... Um, I was hoping that the wind will travel through inside and, and it creates the same leverage as the reverse. But my theory is incorrect. So I gotta do some modifications to the leading edge to compensate. But these two prototypes, the two different ones, reverse and uh, forward, and they are prototype made from heavy material, manufactured by uh, Farm Energy Inc. And the stand is wobbly a little bit, but again, it's everything is prototyping here. I know some of you are waiting for you were waiting for the the real thing to spin. A few of my buddies on the keeping track of my projects and ideas and so this is the first video um, but again I'm not happy with a few things obviously you can tell that the center is wobbling and yeah so much wasted energy here and there and there's wasted energy in the sh the whole structure is wobbling so everything throws this whole thing off but what do you do when you know these are resources what we have and make the best of them but the concept works and you guys all remember my little PVC laying down there and now is the new generation which is the airfoil Torque on this is amazing. Holy crap, let's see. There's a gust of wind, five. And it just takes off. Okay, well, this is the first video. I'm gonna get this one going and uh, modify the leading edge and see how I'm, I'm going to compensate to the efficiency of the foil it wants to go but and um, I'll get you another tape going on this one just to show you the differences are as fast as it's going to go go go
better not fly on me. Beautiful looking though. They gotta give me that. <laughs> well, the idea is for uh, this to be um, spinning no more than 500 RPM, and at 200 RPM, there's no power, you, you know, usable power. So past 200 RPM, that's where the power start uh, creating power, so usable power after 200 RPM. So this way it doesn't stall, or it doesn't, you know. And that's uh, at nine kilometers per hour. So the plan was always um, to, to spin at 200 uh, RPM at 10 kilometers per hour. So over 10 kilometers per hour and then it starts using, uh, creating good power. We'll see how this goes. Sam out. <laughs>